Hi, I'd like to show you guys a few features of the new Polarad lens in Slide Deck 2. So here I have some of my uh, Instagram favorites. And as you can see, we've got a bit of tape at the top and a very subtle drop shadow at the bottom of this lens. If I change colors here, you can see a little bit better. And we have these really cool looking navigation arrows. And you get that s sort of cool Polaroid effect. This lens also has a couple configuration options. For instance, you can change the color of the lens from new to aged, give it sort of that yellow look, and then even change it to attic, where you actually get a textured, damaged looking slide. The layout style can be changed from single to a few different variations. So here's one that's called three wide, and it shows three slides at a time. Um, it sets the height intrinsically, so if you want to use this variation, you'll probably need to start off with a larger size. The arrows can also be changed. For instance, you can change the arrow style down here. You get a nice little drop down of the different thumbnail styles. And if I go back to appearance, we can take a look at some of the other variations. There is a peak variation where the previous and next slides sort of peak out from the sides. There is a stacked variation where all of the slides are stacked like a stack of Polaroids and this is using CSS rotations so they're all random every time and you can see the stack gets shoved behind when you get to the last one it's a really cool effect we really like it you can toggle the drop shadow and the tape on and off if you wanted a cleaner looking slide as well so I hope that gives you guys a, uh, a nice insight into what the Polarad lens looks like.